welcome back to my channel it's your girl Kanisha and I'm back better and fabulous and today this is I want to say day two of birthday prep and day two is um we're going to be doing a dress haul and it's going to be a combination of Shein dresses from my Canadian girls um urban planets sirens dresses uh pretty little things like it's just gonna be a compilation of all i'll try to put the links to the dresses that i can find in the description below um some of these dresses are brand new some of them i've had for a while but let's get into it so let me go try on the first dress and i'll be back in a minute and oh if y'all haven't seen part one yet, part one should be my installation to this long, pretty hair. I don't think I showed you how long it is, but there we go. Um, I low-key kind of gave up on that video towards the end, um, so it will be a better video, but I think it turned out great. Like, I think it turned out great. But, okay, so let me go get the first dress, try it on, and we'll be right back. So this is just number one. I'm not wearing no one's trainer. I'm not wearing no um, shaper. I'm just letting everything hang out today. Okay, so this is the dress. Let me lower the camera a little bit. Okay. So this is the dress. It is extremely short. Like, it's extremely short. If I bend over, everything, everything gonna be hung up. All my goodies, everything. I would definitely need some type of blue paint or something to hold the girls up because the only structure that's here is this. This is this is the only thing that has a wire. Everything else is sheer. We got the arm. You can look at the detailing on the arm. We got some spots and glitter. Okay, I think this is really cute. I got it in a size large, and I'm not mad at it because if I was to get an extra large. It would be a B to make. Like this is just just fine. I love the little ruching detail that it has on it. Um, but yeah, hopefully y'all can see the whole dress. No my to the toes, but this is it. But like, like I feel it riding up. Like if you were gonna, you if you were gonna bend down, <coughs> sorry, if you're gonna bend down, you have to do like one of them, you know, one of them kind of. And even even if I feel my ass, I feel my ass cheeks right now, just out there. But this is just number one. Got it from she in in the size large. Y'all are on the same body shape, shape, same body shape type, maybe. I don't think this is tall girl for me. I'm five seven, and you know, my little cousin when I showed it to her, she said, "Can you just on a dress? That's a top." You know, my cousin Tayla. Watch my previous videos. You know who she is. Um, yeah. Okay, let's get into the next dress. So this is dress number two. Once again, no shapewear, no waist trainer, everything hanging out. This I got into, got in an extra large and. And in love with it. It's longer, it's stretchier than the last one. Very, very comfortable. I love the ruching detail. It camouflages the belly, the fupa. Um, I love it. I absolutely love it. I got this once again from Shein in a size extra large. And this is giving classy. Okay, this is giving classy. Put the back. Everything about this now. The one thing that I don't really like about it, like look at this. You see the glitter that's on there. Um, the arms are also ruched. The only thing I don't like, I've seen, like I've seen the glitter fall off. Like the glitter is just looks like it's pasted. The glitter looks like it's pasted on, but like fabric glue or something. So I don't know about that. Let's put a pack on that. Like this is super cute. I feel like this is gonna be the birthday dress. But y'all will find out when the photo shoot comes out. Yes, I'm doing the photo shoot. So this video is also um, to help me and to show y'all um, the dresses that I have and to help me pick and stuff. So this one is really cute. I feel like you can dress it up. You can add a bow. Um, 
this is supposed to lay tight like that. It's cute. Please ignore the straps. Um, I just couldn't find my shopping bra right now. So, yeah, next dress. So, this is dress number three. Um, it's pretty long. I don't, I'm still trying to decide if I like this dress. I love the color. Like, this is very summer S dress. Let me go to the little bit of the park. Let's go to the beach and just walk across the beach, you know? I like the little faux, like, flap things. So, you know, it still covers what it needs to cover, but it still has that cute little flap. What I don't like about this dress, let me go closer, is this cut right here. I hate dresses that have that, like, ugh. And I don't know what is going on right here. Like, what it, like, Am I supposed to pull it down? Is it supposed to go in? Like, I don't... Or am I supposed to pull it? Oh, give me sure you go down. Okay. So you pull it. You pull it to get it to your desire. And okay, the reason here is the main reason, like, because, you know, we trying to hide that. And, Really, I bought this, but I will wear a sh uh, shape wear for this just because it is very like <sighs> it outlines everything clearly. You see my belly button, all that. Um, but yeah, I got this from Siren. This is in a size extra large for all my Canadian girls out there. You know, like mm, this dress isn't like one of my favorites. This is something I would throw on if I had somewhere to go. Um, last minute or like a bike or something like even then I don't know I'm debating if I should return or not but for now we don't keep this is dress number four four okay so I got this one from Fashion Nova it's an extra large and once when I first got it I'm not gonna lie I didn't like it I did not like it at all. I was like, Kenny Kyle, what were you thinking? What were you thinking? What you like? And honestly, this was sitting in my closet, sitting in my closet. Um, I found so many closets that like fashion over to me with like strings and stuff coming off of it. I don't want to burst or something, but um, yeah, this is the dress, the back and the zip up because. I'm not gonna go through the hassle. It's basically like a turtleneck, so it buttons up at the neck. <sighs> like, it's a velvety dress. I love the feeling. I don't know about the pattern, but I feel like I would wear it somewhere. Like, you know, if I'm trying to be like cute, bougie. I don't know what kind of. Tell me in the comment section what vibe you think it's giving, because I really don't know. I'm thinking this is like a New Year's. Kind of dress because of like the, the brown, like the it's giving like gold, you know. And so she said it's like a turtleneck. You can let me know what y'all think. But this is for fashion over. This is an extra large, and I kind of like it. Next year. So this is dress number five now. I know y'all gonna be saying, Kenisha, I've seen this dress before. Yes, yes, you have. For those of y'all that haven't followed me for some time, y'all wanna know that I wore this on my birthday last year. So this was my birthday dress. But I didn't really get to do um, any details on the dress because I didn't buy as much clothes as I did this year. So I said, I might as well add it in. So this dress is from Pretty Little Things. It's a size medium, UK 16, and I just loved it. Last year, the theme was rose gold, and I felt like this met, um, did, did what we're supposed to do, okay? It, it's giving classy, but it's also giving sexy. You know, you can put it down, you can put it up. Like, I just love it. It's, it's not too short, it's not too long, and the material is a great, suede material I just I just love it now these pockets are like everything about it like if y'all I'll show y'all some pictures from last year of me wearing the dress but this is breathable I would able to walk walk and do my thing okay 
Next dress. So this is the next dress. I love the color. I love the vibe. This is another birthday dress. Well, it was supposed to be. But, so I got this from a little boutique um, at my local mall. Um, if I can remember the name of the boutique or whatever, I'll put it up on the screen. But this is a size of medium. And I'm surprised because it fits. Obviously, not really, but it fits. Put on a little shape here and it's a fit. Um, okay, so let me get up for a close and personal with y'all. So, the one thing that I didn't notice about the dress when I got it was that there was a tee in here. So, I'm not gonna have to sew it because honestly, I could wear this this summer. Even for like my birthday trip, I could wear this and take cute pictures in it. Who goes on? Who goes on? You know? Um, and another thing that I noticed is that maybe it's because it's. Maybe it's because it's like medium, but when I actually, I have worn this dress once, and when I did wear it, let me tell you, I was walking around, walking around, laughing, having a fun time, come to find out that my, the string here was undone, and like, my shirt was like, I was like, weird. so now I'm like extra careful with tying this, but this is the dress, it's nice medium. I think it's pretty cute. Next dress. So this is the next dress. I actually really do like this dress. I like the little detailing at the side. Please excuse me, bra. I was not about to come on camera with no bra for this dress because as you can see, these don't really cover anything. Like the one flaw that I think they made with this dress is that they didn't want the strips, strips, straps adjustable because if not, like it would have been so perfect. I could use blue tape or something and just, but I might have to get a tailored or something because I really do like this dress. I got this in a size extra large. Yeah, I got it in a size extra large and I worn it once when I, when I did wear it. Because you're, like, you're probably gonna be like, Kenisha, if it was Big Bang, how did you wear it before? I did wear it, but I bought like a lace bralette to wear under it, so it looked like it was lacy, lacy here. To try and kind of camouflage kind of that. But this is also from um, Cyrus. Um, yeah, I really do like this. I like the length, I like the material. I like how it hides. The only thing I don't like is the straps. Like the straps is like I would wear this dress on every chance I got if the straps were right. Like it's just so disappointing because yeah. And then I believe I have one more dress to try out for, and then that will be the end of the haul. Give me a moment. So. This is the next dress. Um, once again, it's a short one, but I feel like I could just uh, put on some sneakers with a nice little shoulder purse, and you know, every day, every day, like this is something I'd wear to a barbecue if I was gonna wear sneakers or something. I don't think I'd wear this anywhere else. To be honest with you, I would definitely have to put on um, some. If anything, I probably put on biker shorts or anything, but like you know, the short ones. And yeah, this is. I don't know how I feel about this one. This one is cute. It's it's vibrant. I love the color. But it's a matter of where I'm gonna wear it to, cause I don't know. And like, it's it's the shortness for me, like. This is supposed to be a dress. This is why I say a lot of dresses, they say dresses, but they're not, they not tall girl friendly. Because I'm only 5'7". They're not tall girl friendly. So, I'm gonna definitely have to wear like something underneath it. Um, because if I was to bend over, everything would be out. Now I got one more dress for y'all. I kind of lied in the last one. I said this would be the last one. I got one more dress for y'all. I just realized it. Um, and then 
gonna be the end of the video, all right? So get on, I'm gonna try it off and be right back. I just realized that I recorded the whole video without my ring light on, so I'm sorry, but the show must go on. So this is the last and final dress. Got it from Fashion Nova. I believe it's a large. I believe, I was trying to see if I could find the tag, can find the tag. I believe it's a large. If not large, then definitely an extra large. And once again, if y'all have been following me for a while, um, from last year, y'all would have seen this dress. It was in my vlog for my birthday. It was in my Instagram photos. It was posted in my Snapchat. Y'all would have seen this because I wore this on, well, the pink dress I wore the night on my birthday. This I wore the day. And yeah, I just love it. It's it's stretchy, it's breathable, nice. I wore this at the time I didn't have a waist trainer. So I wore it with, no, at the time I didn't have a body shaper. So I wore a waist trainer and the waist trainer hid perfectly underneath it. I was shocked because my waist trainer is kind of bulky. Like it's the one where you zip it up and yeah so i was surprised that it hit it so well but it did no one can tell and i just love this dress like i could not bra with it i usually don't like like the square like the flat thing but this i may wear so i just threw on a little um wind black windbreaker over it with some i believe i wore flats that day yeah I'll put a picture or a video or whatever I can find of me wearing this dress right here. But yeah. So this is the end of the haul of birthday prep part two. Now that I'm gonna get this after my birthday, just so you know. Just maybe we'll get it before. But more than likely we'll get these videos after. Um so enjoy. Stay tuned for part three. We are going to get our nails done, but I feel like my nails and the photo shoot are going to be matched into one because I'm not going to sit there and record a whole nail session. Nah, nah. I'll record probably going there, um, maybe some clips in between, and then the photo shoot. So, hope y'all enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Tell a friend to tell a friend to tell a friend to tell your uncle, auntie, mama, daddy, cousin that we are lit over here. Yeah.